what can you do about eye bags? It, it's a really annoying answer, but it kind of depends on the kind of eye bags you've got. And what I mean by that is, I mean, we all know what eye bags look like, don't we? I mean, they're these pouchy, saggy bits you get underneath the eyes, but they could be loose excess skin. They could be kind of filled up with fluid and therefore a bit puffy. If the fat pads that sit under your skin and keep it all lovely and smooth under your eyes when you're young, if those have detached, have slumped down, have bunched up and gathered, if you could have the kind of festoons sort of which are like extra swags that skin that come down here you know there's a lot of different presentations so what can you do with tweetless and skincare for eye bags in terms of skincare you know there's nothing that skincare will do to get rid of eye bags but what you can do is use a lightweight cream with active ingredients which will help strengthen the skin and get it into really good condition so that's the best you can do. You might get creams with retinol in it, which can strengthen the skin and make it hydrate itself better and soften the wrinkling effect. But it's not going to treat the intrinsic bagginess, if that makes sense. You know, there's three creams which I think are really great for eyes on the shop on my website. But in terms of what you're looking for, you're looking for something that will hydrate the skin and which will recondition the skin. So the skin is in great shape. And then in terms of tweakments, well, a lot of people will think about injecting the under eye area with dermal fillers, which can help, but it really depends on your eye bags. And I would not want to give general advice on that. I would say go and find a brilliant practitioner like the ones on my website and ask their opinion, because if you've got the sort of under eye area that's already holding onto fluid and giving you puffy eye bags, you absolutely don't want hyaluronic acid injected in that because that will make the area hold on to more water and that will only make the problem worse. So it really depends. You could try a treatment like uh, a Tixel, which is a heat treatment that sort of shrinks the skin all over the face, but can be used in the eye area or radio frequency treatment or a microneedling treatment. Again, those are working on the quality of the skin but they're not really going to treat the puffiness. You could also try lovely, gentle, lymphatic drainage, massage techniques, that kind of thing. But they're not going to get rid of that intrinsic puffiness. You know, the, the, the one thing that may do the job most cleanly and properly is surgery and lower blepharoplasty. But, you know, I know for most people, surgery is a step too far, the expense, the recovery, you know, the whole palaver of it, let alone the thought of having this very delicate area of your face cut with a scalpel. All of this information and a good deal more you can find on my website. And there's also a downloadable fact sheet with everything you could want to know about how to help eye bags look better.